think everybody who meets her believes she'll be president someday. There's nobody here in Gonzales who's told me I can't do something. Everybody's like, you're gonna be a president, you're gonna accomplish so much. Cindy is one of a kind student. The way that she carries herself, the way that she interacts with others, the way that uh, she cares for her community, for her school. She is one of the most phenomenal leaders I've ever met. Her leadership skills are just out of this world. She's able to draw people in from all sides of the community, business people, city council members. She's very well known in the community. She is very well respected. People know her because of the accomplishments that she has done and because she is very involved in the community. I went to the meeting yesterday to support the youth. I've always been a workaholic. It's just like in me. I, I don't know if it's like maybe my trauma that I feel like I all have to do something. I have to be worthy. I have to be resilient. Um, and I have like this moxie that I just like want to do everything. Do you know where Casa de Oro is? I thought I was like on top of my game. And then my body kind of started giving me signs. Um, simple things like holding my pencil became very difficult. Picking up my backpack was something very stressful. I started noticing that my knees would get swollen. So we all have an immune system that's supposed to protect us from bad things like bacteria or viruses and so on and so forth. Uh, with lupus, your immune system tends to get confused and starts attacking the good parts of your body. It has been uh, days that uh, I've seen Cindy with pain, but she's still here. She pushes herself beyond the limits, beyond the limits to, to be uh, responsible for her academics and her education. It's just a really powerful story to come from, you know, so many difficulties and to be fighting things like lupus, then to come out and say, yes, I'm going to college, yes, I'm going to be successful and then also to turn around and bring it back to everybody else and say, you too can make it. I am carrying on my shoulders all the women in my family. None of them had the experiences that I've been able to have. I've been able to experience so many things that people in my family haven't, and college is just like, it just tops it. Like, I get to have an education, and I get to hopefully be able to use that for good and to be of service to others.